I'll get into this quickly because this video is quite long, I think. I've not edited it yet, but it seems quite long. Today what we're doing, more lambing, obviously. Getting on, getting down the numbers. We've not got so many left now, really. I wanted to get some more videos, but it's just been flat out, so I'm, I've only got two. I'll get another two, probably. Um, let's, let's get into it. it. If you're not subscribed already, um, don't forget to subscribe down there. And if you are subscribed, click the bell icon, you'll get notified of all my videos, um, upcoming videos. I've got plenty of them coming, especially this summer after I finish GCSEs. We'll be flat out with the videos then. And also, leave a like. Let's see if we can get to 300 likes on this video. Um, smash the like target last time, so see if we can do that again. Right. Hope you enjoy the video. Oh, it makes me so slim. Come and enjoy a lambing time and get thin. Yeah, that'll do. Yeah, you are a diddly dodly. Don't film this. We never get diddly dodly. <laughs> what we're doing here is we're moving this yow and these two lambs into a bit of a. I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll, I'll do it. You what? What we're doing here, oh. we have one very small lamb. Who a lamb? We're going to take it into the building, give it a feed of its mother. We've got one big lamb, one small lamb, so we're going to take it in. Thank you. Oh, Amen. Poor thing. So the owl follows its lamb, you know, it knows its scent, it knows its blade. So really, if it's a good mother, you can do this with any owl, because you just walk with them. Which is quite useful actually, I'd better get on, because I'm being left behind. What's going on in lambing? We've managed to get a bit of a shadow. Got all that, got the metal working. So we're getting bricks, sliding door here. Bricks, grain side, not grain side, feed bin, that side, and then two opening doors. Absolute cracking. And then we're getting a hole in there and whatnot, cleaning this out, such a mess. But it's waterproof at least. Get off your phone, man, do some work. What are we doing now, father? I'm giving it a bit of titty. Bit of titty, bit of titty. Feeding it. Do you like it? There's Father, absolute moving along. He's taking some lambs out. And then me and Henry, who you've never have seen before. Off, off to look for meows. What I'm doing now, I've just looked around the, um, the twins. Now, um, two two sets of twins. One of my favourite sheep I'm on the farm. Has lambed, quite happy with that. Um, didn't have my camera with me, so I didn't video that. But now I'm going, I brought my camera, going to look around the singles. Um, there's only one field with singles in. Um, let's go and have a gander.
Here you have one of the nicest places on the whole farm. Right next to the river. The river carries on down there. Our land carries on down there. Absolutely lovely down here. Some river down here. The sheep love it as well. There doesn't seem to be many. They seem to be up sheltering away from the sun today. Because it's so sunny. Aye. What a spot. What a spot. I was wrong, the sheep are enjoying it down here. Hello darlings. You're not supposed to be in here. You are not. I think someone might have lambed down there. Let's get another look. Turns out she hasn't lambed, it was just some good grass. Back to the machine. Five hours later. <laughs> no, to do it, um, 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 Tags. We'll just tag it in for that. Yeah. Oh, look at that one in back here. You've got long tags. Do give a lamp. Right up, that's all good there. 149. What a sheep. One of our oldest sheep. Born in the spring of 2010. How many crops will this be then? Eight. Eight, eight. crops? No. It's 19, so... Uh, Seven crops. Seven, eh? Seven. Seventh crop. Seventh crop of lambs, yeah, yeah. <laughs> twins every year. Yeah, we're going to give over. It's a jump like a don't know what. It is, it's a jumper. That's no. what we're doing here. Oh, didn't use that one. Can you get to the long run, Heather? Oh, what we're doing here, as you can see, is we're tagging them, which helps us, I helps us identify them. So that number's one. 1875 I think on that lamb and then we'll put in our book what the lamb's got by what the mother's got by and what, what who the mother is helps us identify them later on um, also they're electronic tags which means that they'll get scanned that'd be a UK database wouldn't it UK database for auctions and stuff so it just makes the whole system a lot easier for everyone. We think this is a bit funny to tummy though, look at it. It's a bit fat, it's a bit bloated we think. Well, it could be it could be rattle belly, could it? A bony little lamb. Your good mother is this yow. Come on, back to your mother. Not grandfather. What we're doing here is we're taking these, which is lambed in the lambing field, with all the lambs in. We're putting them into a trailer. And we're taking them to a better field with more grass, so they can kick on a bit more. I'm going to put them with more grass in. More grass in. Why do we do that, grandfather? Then they do a bit better. Plenty of grass. Make some milk. Keep some feet. Let's see if it's come this morning, isn't it? Where are they? Sorry, I'm moving them off. Get me to the old breeding. Sauce me out. Right, we'll take these over. 